Now it's gonna get some speed. Going downhill, the big jump, and then right through the Jenga block. Hello, everybody. Great to We're checking out a game for the channel called Tracks, the train set game. So with the soft, delicate music playing in the background, you may be thinking that this is a game to ease your tension and lower your blood pressure. Normally, you would be right, except when I'm at the helm. Today, we're going to pick up some passengers and try and put them through the worst possible train experience we can do. So Tracks is a game all about creating just a large train environment in like an open sandbox thing. Now over here, there is some level selects. This is uh, very early right now, you understand? The link's in the description below. This originally came out on Itch a while back when I saw it. There wasn't a lot to it, so I kind of just like left it alone. It had trains in it, so I knew I was going to enjoy it. I was just waiting for a little bit more substance. And the more substance is here. Over here, we have a clear environment or a modern apartment. We definitely want to do the modern apartment. There's just more stuff that can be done here, and it unlocks the passengers mode. Build a track system to take passengers to their destinations. You can do this normally as well, but I think this is going to be like the beginning of what this game kind of is eventually going to entail, which maybe, you, you know, you have to complete various little things to go on and unlock new tracks and stuff like that. Now, if we go ahead and play as we do... Passengers will appear around the room. Open the toy box and drop a platform close to where they are waiting. Yes! Right over here, these little woodmen. Little wooden dudes hanging out. Build some track to your new platform and stop there to let passengers onto your carriages. No problem. You can see 0 of 10 right now, so 10 must be our passengers. And over here, a fantastic looking station just <laughs> lingering on the sofa. Because, I don't know, the kid left it there. Drop the passengers off at the station to proceed. Oh, you guys are going to be wishing you never took the friggin' Gray Express over here. So, the game fairly simplistic to get the hang of. As it works, you have tracks, uh, well, obviously, but what you can do is you can left-click to put them down. You can right-click to put them up. When you put them down, you can use your mouse wheel or I think the Q and the E keys, yeah, to bring it up and or down. And then there's like an alternate mode that you can have as well, where you can hold down the Alt button. And then you can kind of make different things happen with the tracks. You notice over here, we can kind of make it go to the right or the left. But here's the cool part. So on top of all this, we have the toy box, which if we press G, we can open up. And yes, all kinds of things are here, man. Just like, I unlocked some of it. It looks like once you unlock it, it stays unlocked for right now. Probably just because, like I said, it's like an early access style of thing. So if we want, look at this. We've got a speed check. Okay. Oh, that's interesting. All right. Now we can clear that by just pressing the C button. I want to unlock all this. You can also go inside of the train with T where you get to legitimately drive it as you do. I'm just going to go ahead and uh, kind of stop it and leave it here for the moment. Do the uh, space bar to go ahead and stop it. Let's get out of this and go back to our, go back to our toy box. So we want to make the worst possible train experience these people could have. So what should we do over here? Let's see. Well, oh, there's blocks, by the way. Let's go ahead and unlock those because we can use those to uh, have people go smashing through them. You can also rotate it with the R button. And then on top of that, I think that you can move them from side to side on the grid by pressing 1 and 2. Yes, you can. So that's kind of like a diagonal way to put it down. That's kind of interesting. So let's start with some simplistic tracks and then let's add the hazards. And I definitely want like a jump or something like that. Like when we're picking these people up, I want there to be some sort of like raise up and go down to the ground before we ever let them off. There should be some different places around here. Yeah, we got another station over here. I think if we go back over to our toy box, wedding station. Oh, we can put it down. All right. Well, I don't feel like doing that right now. Spawn normal, spawn business, spawn wedding. Definitely want that wedding spawn. I think I've already unlocked that, so I don't think there's anything else for me to do. You know what? Let's just unlock all this right now. We should have plenty of money for it. What in the world is this? It's like a Jenga set. Oh, we're going to be running that over. Look at this. We got houses and stuff. Now, one of the first things I tried was to run the train into the house. Sadly, it just went straight through the house like it didn't actually exist. So the houses are more to just look sweet and provide something like a little bit of a background. I wonder how big this room is. Like, can you go past the walls of this room? Oh, you sure can. Yep. You can just leave the room behind if you want to. I don't... Oh, there's a red line over here. Can I go past this? Yep. Can go past the line as well. You can just float off into the nether realms if you really wanted to. All right, let's start with our tracks over here. 
Going straight for the corkscrew track because it looks freaking sweet. Actually, let's do another. Can I put these wherever I want or do they have to be on a flat surface? Ah, so they have to be on a flat surface. That's fine though. I think that we actually have flat surfaces that we can do. Not just platform, but I think there's a thing called a deposit. What is this? What is this? It's like a plum and co. Oh, it's like, uh, this must be maybe for cargo or something like that. I don't see cargo in the game quite yet, but I think it may be a thing that's eventually coming. That's kind of interesting. I'm going to go ahead and like save that for later. Terrain block. Here it is. It's basically just like a giant mattress. That's essentially what it is. I think you can just throw this on the ground. Yeah, you sure can. Can we do, uh, can we do a bunch more? Can we do more than one? Yeah. Yeah, we sure can. All right, so we got our secondary corkscrew. How far over do we have to go? Actually, you know what? Doesn't matter how far over we have to go because we're going to be going all over the place. Let's uh, let's just start turning here for right now. Now, I think if we want to... Oh, no, you know what? I got it. I know what we'll do. We don't have to just end it. What we can do is we can go down like this, I do believe. Down even further. And now we can put tracks here. And now I think that we can if we want to... Oh, yeah. There we go. Now we got some jumps going on. We need a little bit of an incline here for these people, though. We want them to, as they're gaining speed, we want them to really go flying. So let's put that right about like, oh, yeah, that's, oh, right about like there. There we go. Okay, C to get rid of a current selection. Oh, yeah. That's perfect. Will it land on here? I don't know. We're going to have to find out eventually. For right now, though, let's keep going with our stuff. Go down here, bring it on down, bring it on down. We do have to make a platform, which I haven't made yet. But right now, I just kind of want this thing to land on the ground. Okay, that's... Uh, you know what? Yeah, we're going to go ahead and do that. That's fine. And now, let us go to the toy box. Let us grab our freaking station of greatness, which I apparently have to unlock. And now, we'll put it... Uh, yeah, we'll put it right over there. There we go. Now, it sends a little radar pulse out. So all you guys over there, are you impressed with the station? Would you like to go on it, perhaps? Do I need more track? Perhaps I need more track. Let us continue with the track to make them slightly more impressed, perhaps. All right, we got some craziness going on here, boys. I don't even know. I don't know how well this is going to work. All right, and then it turns over here at the station. Yeah, it's close enough. And now we just need, I assume we just need to connect it back over. Let me, let me finish connecting this over here real quick. And then I'll show you the hideous, the hideous being that I have created. There we go. Perfect. But what? Well, all right. Hold on. Perfect. Okay. So what we've got is the train goes around, goes up the corkscrew into a double corkscrew. Does a little jump and do over here. Going to fly down onto this, pick everyone up. Everyone's probably going to be sobbing as they see where and where and what the train has come from. Down here, the train probably going to slam into this TV unless it doesn't actually exist. Down a couple more jumps, like it's no big deal. Through the lovely, very trendy looking new age chairs into this box area that has already fallen over. Into a large box tower, which has not fallen over. I'm pretty happy about that. We're going to be climbing up. Why are we climbing up? So that we can eventually go up another corkscrew. Do a jump over the sofa. And then hopefully land right over here by the station. There's no way this is going to work. But I'm going to try it anyway. Alrighty. So join me as we step inside of our train for the very first time. Look at us, nice and calmly going up the tracks over here. Now, this is still a fairly simplistic style of track. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and watch it from the outside over here. Will we make, will we stick the landing? Yes! <laughs> oh, it sticks the landing. Actually, let's watch it all the way through. Double landing. Yep. Yeah, what? No! <laughs> the train just went flying it. Oh, crap. All right. So our train ended up crashing into a wall. That's not exactly what I wanted to have happen. I think if we hold down on the T button. Yes, okay, good. It resets itself back in the beginning. All right, let's go ahead and do an emergency stop over here. So that worked out surprisingly well, like way better than I thought it was going to work. Uh, what we need to do though, is we need to change this a little bit. Let's, uh, let's clear some of this up because it needs a little bit more space to land. But it definitely works. So let's, uh, hold on. Let me, uh, let me raise up a little bit over here. There we go. Okay. I think I've got everything set up. This actually got even weirder down here. I'm pretty sure it can stick this landing. 
They go around, and then it's gonna... Oh, I haven't even... Have I even connected these? Oh, okay, I did. I was gonna say, then it goes around here, comes down here, smashes through the blocks, comes through the Jenga set, piles on over here, up this way, goes past the dinner table, another corkscrew, because why not? Jumps over the couch, into the station, and we should be good. Okay, let's freaking do this. We're doing this. Here we go. This time, we're gonna pilot it, though. We wanna see if we can pick everyone up. Oh, the screaming sounds of the pudding... Of the, the pudding... <laughs> Of the poor wooden block people. It's gonna be lovely. You boys ready? Boys ready to do some death defying jumps? Here we go. Here we go! <laughs> yes, good. All right. Let's go ahead and slam on the brakes over here as we do. Back it on up. Now, again, I don't know. Oh, you know what? It's a platform. That's what they need. Not a freaking station. It's a platform. Let's try that. Let's see how do I how do I how do we want this put over here? Can I put it right? Oh yeah, it's perfect, perfect, right there. There it is. That's what it was this whole time. Yes. Come on, come on, everyone. Yes, pile on in. Trains all here. Why don't you guys step onto the? Uh, why don't you guys step into the passenger area? Perfect. Oh, you guys are gonna have a fantastic. Uh, not a flight. A fantastic ride. Yes, a fantastic train ride. You guys are gonna really enjoy this. All right. Let's freaking do this. I'm gonna get this thing going at full steam. All right. Okay, looking good. Let's hop on out of here so we can watch it. Okay, does the jump. Nope, doesn't stick the second jump. All right, I need to move this back a little bit. Oh, it stuck it somehow. Yes! Destroy the blocks. Leave no stone und undestructicated my train of death. Oh, look at it go. Look at it go. Big jump. Land it. Yeah. Oh, wow. Okay, wow, that worked out. Whoa! Okay, slow down, slow down, slow down. Th that worked out perfect! I don't know how, like, we landed on the ground, but somehow it went back onto the train. I'm not, the train tracks, I'm not gonna question it. That seemed to work out just fine. Let's go ahead and stop things down right over here. Everyone, get off! That's right. Everyone pile out of the trains. <laughs> Even though it's still moving because we're in this horrible downhill decline a new set of passengers have arrived somewhere find them and bring them back to the first station on the sofa okay well we can go fluttering like this and find out exactly where they are at uh, oh they're just on the other side you know what though we've done well but we need like we need some uh some stuff we need like some background material we need some decorations and things like that i definitely like our our jenga block set this is interesting you can put you can put the terrain like inside of other terrains so you can make like little l shapes and stuff like this they don't have to be perfect i'm just putting down some houses over here i think it would be nice if while screaming to their deaths our people would go through perhaps a nice a nice town or a cityscape or something. Now, can you jump this over? Ooh, you can. There we go. What else we got over here for decoration? Lamps, walls, fences. Ooh, trees. Oh, you can put trees down. Oh, yeah. This place is going to look like home while everyone's exploding through it. It's going to be freaking great. You can, you, you can almost, like, put the trees on the tracks. Can you put the trees on the toppers over here? Oh, you can. You can put them right down on the, uh... Look at this. You can put them right down on the tabletops like this. Oh, isn't that nice? Boy, like decorative shrubs. I'm a big fan of decorative shrubs. Oh, we have even more decorative shrubs over here. These shrubs are particularly decorative. There we go. We got some woodlands back over here. That looks pretty legit. Now, now that I think we have everything set up as we do, we're going to need to put train tracks over here to pick these people up. But not only that, we're going to have to put them through the ringer as well. So we've got to figure out a good way to make the train go ballistic all over the place with its populace in tow. All right, we need plenty of block towers over here. Oh, yeah, this is going to be... Oh, don't you fall on me. Look at it starting to sway. Oh, it's because it's leaning up against this thing over here. Oh, this is so precarious. Whatever, though. It seems like it's working just fine. I'm going to put another one over here. Don't you... F yes, perfect. Good. Good. Another one right over here. Oh, that one went down. You know what? That's actually perfect. It fell right across the tracks. Our poor train's gonna have to fight its way through the pain and the agony. So we should be able to connect right over here, which should bring us into the rest of the... Tr I think this is gonna work. I'm pretty sure this is gonna work. 
There's a there's a somewhat strong possibility of this working. All right. I think I've got everything set up as I want. The cool part is is that they're going to do a little jump straight through the block tower over here to two more block towers. We've got a couple of blocks looming over here as they do. Oh, this should be this should work out just fine. All right. So now into the train we go. Choo choo suckers. Go ahead and bring things along here. Start putting our uh, accelerator down as we do. And I think we can probably go ahead and watch this. I put an extra passenger. Oh, crap. Well, our train just went flying off the roadway there. Oh, it's going off into the nether realm. No. No. Train. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Don't go off into the nether realm, train. Oh. Stop. Stop. Thank you. Okay, good. Okay, so... Best laid plans, let me, uh, one piece of track caused all this horror, ah, uh, crap, caused all this horror to occur. There we go. Okay. Now everything should be set. All the tracks should be interconnecting for the most part. Everything should be at full speed right now. Okay. Full speed ahead. Looking good. Let's go ahead and raise ourselves up over here. Now we've got the, the first death defying jump, which should be made with no big deal and... Sticks to landing. Okay, first jump is down. Through the boxes. Out of the way, boxes. Oh, yeah. Down to the second jump. Down to the third jump. Oh, wow. I totally circumvented a huge part of the... Ugh! Well, that's good to know. So while the tracks can manipulate their way right through the, uh, the terrain here, the train cannot. Okay, let's go ahead and fix that real quick. All right, let's give it a shot. We should be good to go now. Start the train up here. Oh, you glorious acrobat of a train. Make horrible things happen for me. Okay. So the train is off. All right. Train's doing good so far. Now, this jump has never been a problem. So here we go. Here's the first jump. Sweet jump right there. Let's go ahead and run into the... Yes! Run into the block tower. Block tower down. Jumps down. Jumps down again. All right. Goes in a little circle. do over here. Looking good. Looking good. Now, oh, you know what? I had to have the train. Hold on. I think we can fix this. Hold on. Slow down. Slow down. Emergency stop. Emergency stop. Stop. All right. I think you can change which way you go on the tracks. So let's go ahead real quick. We're going to go and go back here, and then we're going to switch the tracks so that we make that turn because we need to make that turn over there. There we go. There we go. Yes. And then through the brick towers. Ain't got no time for your towers! Yeah! Get them! Get them! Wow, got them pretty good, actually. That worked out. That worked out a lot better than I thought it would. Oh, hold on. I think we're gonna be able to stop just in time, too. Watch this. Watch this. Oh. Oh, you know what? I may have to put the tracks on the other side. I wonder if they'll... I wonder if they'll get on from the wrong side of the platform. Let's find out. I don't... I don't think they will. No. Okay. So the platform has to be around the other way. I should actually just be able to rotate the platform, I imagine. Hold on. Can I can I erase the platform without killing all the people? No problem. We got this set up. Watch this. We're going to go ahead and back our way down here. No big deal. And then we can just swap the tracks over. I've got so many track... I got so much track swapping going on here. I don't know if this is going to work or not. Come on, baby. Push your way up that hill. Push your way up that hill. We got the whole... You know, one-tenth of a quarter of a horsepower going on over here. There we go. There we go. Perfect. Yes. Look at how happy everyone is. Everyone's like, oh, I've heard of this train. It's a grand old time. That's right. Pile on in. You poor saps. We're going for a friggin' ride. Now, the only problem is we don't have a lot of speed. Oh. Well, that's, that's terrible. Ah! <laughs> Back down to the ground we go. All right. We're going to try and drive this ourselves. I just have to remember all the transitions. We have our passengers inside over here. A lot of the bricks are already destroyed. So it shouldn't be a big deal. This is going to be our first time doing the first person all the way through our hideous track over here. There we go. There's that first jump right through the boxes. All right, working good. Now we got to get ready. We got to get ready because we have to make a turn. Whoa, I couldn't even make that turn. Oh, wait. No, I think this could be fine. We're gonna be able to, we're gonna be able to do it. We're gonna be able to do it. Ready? Right there. Right there. Did it. Passed all this crap. Boom shakalaka. Threw all this here. There we go. Coming up. Coming up. Coming up. Okay, good. 
Now we have to turn to the right, okay? Excellent. Well, actually, we didn't need to turn to the right. Turn to the left. <laughs> There's the jump. Yes. Jump number two, jump number three, yes. Everything's working. Everything's working. Look, it's going through our little village. Now it comes up. All right. Back over. Does the super jump. Sticks it. And we are set. We did it, boys. We brought everyone along. We made it. There you go. You guys can, uh, you guys can get. Oh, no, no, no. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We only got one guy off. We have to get everyone off. That sounded terrible. Everyone needs to exit the train. Okay, right there. We did it. Okay, it was all 10. For a second, I wasn't sure we were going to get all 10 because the train likes to rock in between. A set of business passengers are waiting at the dining table. These must be taken to the business station within the time limit. Oh, no. A time limit? Look at the track I made. This is the most inefficient track ever created in the universe. Oh, wow. Uh. Okay. Give me a second. I'm going to see. <laughs> so now it's speed training. Uh, let me see if I could build this track up in some sort of hideous way to make this work. Okay. I think I got it so this works. I think. Uh, now, it said that there was a time limit, but if you if you notice, the time limit has stopped. So I don't know, like, what happens if I hold down on the T? Does it reset the entire board? No, the board doesn't reset. That's interesting. All right, let's just try and go through this and see if we can pick these people up. I'm just really curious to see if we could do it. I just threw something together real hastily. So I got this thing going full bore. We'll go ahead and watch it real quick, do its jumps and stuff. Yes! There it is. There's the jumps of power through all the blocks that are on the ground. Down here we go. There we have it. Comes up here. Now, this needs to go all the way around. So we're going to need to do the transfer. It's got to transfer like this. Go through this freaking wasteland of death and sadness. Go back up here. Okay. Now we're going to transfer over to the right track. All right. Looking good. Now over here, oh, oh crap, oh god, oh no, no, that's not what I wanted. Oh man, I think it's gonna work. I think it's gonna work. I just didn't transfer at the right time before. Now, I'm curious if I'm too far. Oh, you know what? Hold on. I might have to transfer back over here to the front of the pathway for them to get on. Now, I also don't know how close this has to be. Like, it has to be right up against or what? See, if we stop right over here, yeah. See, it's got to be right up against this. So can I remove this, I wonder? Am I allowed to delete this? I'm, I'm, I'm highlighted on it, and I can't delete it. So I'll bet what I would have to do is just move the track so that it's over here. I wonder if I could put down another platform. Like, what happens if you put down another platform? Anything weird happen? Like, will people transfer over here? Will they go to the slightly clo- Oh, yes. Some of them are going to the slightly closer platform. Everyone! Everyone, come on. Come on over to this other platform. This platform's better than the other platform. So what if I've got the two of them glitching together slightly? Yes! Yes! Do as you're told! Everyone on the train of sadness! Alright, let's go, boys! We gotta get- we gotta get there. We gotta get to the station. We only have a- we only have a couple minutes. I say that. We- I think we have plenty of time, realistically, but I'm not gonna worry about it. Here we go. Alright, right over here. Now, I don't remember if there is a, a transfer or something like that at this point. I don't think there is. Okay, we just want to make sure that we bear to the left. All right, got it. Oh, no, we got it. Wow. <laughs> oh, what happened to the train? Oh, what happened to the train? Oh, the train crashed and all the passengers are in fear and sadness. Now, there's a couple of other things I had to check out. In this game... There was auto-saved tracks. I assume these are ones that the developer or something had made. One of them was called Roller Coaster. So I had to check this out. Look at this. I thought I made something hideous. Oh my god. This is... Look at how crazy this is. All right, we gotta try and do this. Now, there are passengers over there. So if I could get them, I would like to try and get them as well. So let's go ahead and get this thing going real quick. Now, what, how many different ways can you go? Look at how many different pathways there are. It's like a million and one pathways. All right. Let's, uh, uh, 
Couple of blocks over here, no big deal. Don't mind me, boys. Don't mind me, just old gray pilot in the train. Nothing to see here. You know, accidents are bound to happen, as they say. Let's go ahead and stop right over here. Everyone should be able to get on the train. There we go. Everyone's hopping and skipping along. They're having a good time. They're talking about how great things are. Pushing the random boxes out of the way. Sorry, folks. Sorry for the clutter. You boys know. All right. Now that we're back inside over here. So we, we need to legitimately maneuver our train around. As a matter of fact, how crazy does this get? Let's try and... Uh, Let's try and use some of the various track stuff over here. So we got this going over here. All right, now there is a, there is like a little twisty do over there, but we don't really need it right now. Holy cow. There is a long drop down here from the corkscrew. Oh, oh, okay, let's take this one. All right, I just took a random track. So now we're on our way. Ah! <laughs> oh, yes! Through all the blocks! Through all the blocks! Destroy the blocks! Uh-oh, where'd the train go? Where'd the train go? It's somewhere way over here. We gotta see if I can find it. I don't even know where it went now. I don't know if it's in a wall or if it... Oh no, it's still going. It's still going, even without me. Fantastic. It destructicated the crap out of all of those blocks over there. Now it looks like there's a nice little jump over here. Oh man, what a landing. Oh God, that is a rough landing right over there. Underneath all this spaghetti work, doing well. And then what's it gonna do? Go down here, all right, underneath. Oh, it's going up. It's gonna go up big time. Oh, it's gonna do the jump too, I think. Yes. Here it is. This is it. This is the momentous jump of power. Oh, we gotta get these blocks set back up. Cause I wanna see this. I wanna see this jump with those blocks. This is it. The gigantic jump of power. Now we go, yes. I cannot believe it landed that. Okay, let's, hold on. We need to reset this, and we need to put those blocks back up. I've got to hit that jump with those blocks set up. All right, I think I got this set. We should be able to do the jump through the Jenga blocks. So we do this turn right over here, and we stay straight. Okay, yeah, this should be it. This should be it. Come on, baby. Push your way up there. Oh, it's having trouble because of the sheer weight. The sheer weight. Oh, I don't know if it's gonna. I don't know if it's gonna do it well enough. See how hard. Look at a hard time it's having. Oh, now it's gonna get some speed. Now it's gonna get some speed. Going downhill, the big jump, and then right through the Jenga blocks. Nothing gets in the way of progress, baby. Welcome to the Steam Age, or I don't know. I guess the Wooden Age. But now, man, when this thing gets going, holy crap, it goes fast. So now there's another board that was made. It was called Small Town, I think it was. We'll go check that out real quick just to see what it looks like. And this is Small Town. What have I done? What's going on over here? My train just went flying. That was interesting. It like ricocheted off the wall and now it's just somewhat stuck under the sofa. Anyway, this is Small Town. Look at this. Wow. Like you can get a lot done in here. Look at this. You got a cool little station over here. We got the fountains sprinkling as they do. Water's coming out of full animation over there. We got the clock tower. It's always, uh, it's always half past, what is that, half past eight? Actually, shouldn't the, you know, this, the hour hand should be like closer to over here or whatever. I'm not gonna worry about it though. Got the clock towers, got some buildings. Now the buildings are inside of our, uh, whatever this unit is over here because I think that this was basically made for the clear board but I'm using it right now in the apartment like the sparse apartment board over here but I just wanted to see what it looks like it looks really cool though like all of the all the structures and all of the the shrubbery and all the plant life and stuff like that and the uh your lighting posts and things really makes for a pretty legit looking scene Anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed this episode of Tracks. Neat little game. A lot of potential here. I really like making the various tracks go flying all over the place and everything. Anyway, folks, until the next time, stay foxy and much love.